Speed, it will soon be a different kind of law and order for Troy Nell. The Fort Bend County Sheriff won his campaign for Congress. Channel 2's Brittany Jeffers is live for us in Fort Bend County with what's next for the congressman elect. Brittany, good morning. Good morning to you. And it was just a few hours ago when Nels called this a truly great win. And this was a particular race that garnered national attention. It is going to truly be an honor and a privilege to represent you in Washington. A new job lies ahead for Fort Bend County Sheriff Troy Nels, now congressman elect for Texas's 22nd congressional district. So I think the people have rewarded me again for my service, my commitment to those that call Fort Bend County and Congressional District 22 home. The district, which stretches to the south and west of Houston into booming suburbs, was considered a battleground in this election after Congressman Pete Olson announced he wouldn't seek re-election. The race became contentious against Democrat Shri Preston Kulkarni, with both sides running attack ads. Nels ultimately took home the most votes last Last night, though his opponent hasn't officially conceded from the race. Nell says his next step will be a trip to Washington for congressional orientation. And while this is his first national race, Nell says he won't lose focus on the local issues. We have an aging infrastructure, right? We've dealt with some of the most horrific flooding in the last several years. So we got to talk about flood mitigation. We got to talk about serving our veterans. So as far as voter turnout is concerned, uh, according to the Fort Bend County Judge KP George, he says more than 358,000 voters from Fort Bend County voted in this presidential election. Reporting live this morning in Richmond, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC Channel 2 News. Brittany,